Hey, Shook. Welcome back to the Healing Circle. So we're here to do a then, now, next message for Aries. Okay, this is a then, now, next message for Aries. Now, if the reading does not resonate, don't try to make it, okay? And you will know if it's resonating, if it's making sense, okay? Tarot is meant to um, give you confirmation on what you already intuitively know. All right, so let's get into it. And we'll also look at your overall message and clarify all of it. Okay. Okay, Aries. So your overall energy is heart fog. Mixed signals, block emotions, clutter. Okay. So this is like an energy of, I don't know how to feel. I don't even know. Like, it's just, I don't know. It's foggy. It's clouded. I don't know. Right? Okay. Well, let's see. What happened in the recent past? Upheaval. Shock. The unexpected. Trouble. Okay. So in the recent past, there was some type of upheaval. There was some type of upheaval. Okay, that might have occurred. Current energy, concealing, secrets, mysteries, hiding. Okay, there could be something that is hidden from you, or maybe you're concealing something. All right, in the current immediate future, better off, happiness, perspective, clear headspace. So, in immediate future, you're you are more clear. Okay, so with the overall energy being like kind of like unsure, heart fog, I don't even know how to feel, okay, that's, I'm sorry, this energy, right, in the immediate future, you do, you do know how to feel, okay, so, let's clarify, for you Aries, for Aries spirit, please make these messages clear, so that Aries can benefit, and know what's in their highest good, one more, Aries, why is heart fog the overall energy? Mixed emotions, block clutter, block emotions and clutter. Okay. The Eight of Swords energy is feeling limited or stuck. Okay. With the Queen of Swords energy, as far as like what decision to make, all right? When it comes to moving, okay, or moving on, okay, or moving towards, um, maybe what makes you happy, what brings you joy, okay? Matter Cups energy and the Ace of Cups is you, um, maybe, because it's past energy, um, you might have, like, taken steps to give of yourself emotionally to, like, a new beginning, um, maybe to heal things or recover something that might have happened, okay? Um, but the overall energy is that you feel stuck when it comes to this decision, okay? Um, maybe, like to move on or to move forward it's like you don't know how to feel because like you might have put yourself out there to heal or recover a situation and maybe feel different because of this upheaval why this is this upheaval here for aries in a recent past why is upheaval here for aries in a recent past the six of pentacles okay the Six of Pentacles with the Queen of Cups, okay? So this is giving of yourself equally, okay, when it comes to love, okay? Um, the Queen of Pentacles with the Knight of Pentacles is like financial ties, okay? If you had financial ties with someone, they might have been stagnating things or slowing things up, okay? But with the upheaval card in the recent past, is you giving to someone that you love, okay? Giving of yourself emotionally equally okay in a recent past why is upheaval here for aries okay your financial stability could have held things up but you gave equally when it came to love okay all right okay three of cups the will of fortune temperance and the fool. Okay. The people around you, your friends, family, associates might have told you, like, you know, it's time for you to do this. Like, it's time for you to give of yourself emotionally to a situation. Um, and so, in a recent past, you might have, you know, developed more peace when it comes to, like, you know, taking a leap of faith or stepping outside of your comfort zone or um, giving to a situation, okay? 
but with the seven of pentacles energy and the knight of swords and the nine of wands you might be feeling like okay um maybe i shouldn't have done that okay the seven of pentacles energy is like evaluation and review and the knight of swords energy you might be feeling like i made a rush decision okay um because the current energy is concealing okay secrets hiding mysteries why is concealing the current energy for aries okay because overall you're feeling stuck when it comes to some decision right the queen of cups and the three of wands mm -hmm. Okay, you could be concealing or hiding how you feel about a situation, okay, or how you feel, period, okay? Um, because maybe you are waiting on an offer. Maybe you've been waiting on an offer from a king of pinnacles. This can be a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn, right? You're waiting on an offer. You may be waiting for um, reciprocation even, okay? But with the Knight of Pentacles and the Lovers, it's like, but this offer is not coming in, okay? It's like it's taking forever. And so you don't know how to feel. It's like... I'm kind of stuck when it comes to like, you know, this decision, you know, but the trade energy is kind of saying you kind of want to move on. Like you don't know exactly how to move forward. Okay. Because you might've came, come into a situation in the recent past, given equally, given equally emotionally. Um, and your friends and associates might've told you like, this is time. So you took a leap of faith. Right. But you're kind of waiting for the love to be reciprocated. You're, you may be even like hiding how you feel. Okay. Because something has been taking a long time. You're not happy. The Five of Cups and the Ten of Pentacles. Like, I'm sad in this Ten of Pentacles. This could be a family, a, a marriage, a commitment of some kind. You know, you're, you're not happy. Okay? And you feel burdened by this decision. Why is concealing here for Aries? Yeah. The Five of Cups and the Page of Pentacles. Okay? This slow movement is not making you happy and you have been concealing how you feel about it, okay? Yeah. Page of Pentacles and the Queen of Pentacles. If someone like made an offer to someone else, right? Or even like was working on moving things into a better state, you might've felt like that was a betrayal, okay? Yeah. Because this is like past energy. If that if that like happened, okay, you might have felt like that was a betrayal, right? And that five of swords energy is like, you know, being mentally conflicted. It's like now you're kind of you kind of you might be like gaining clarity around like, well, that's what the energy is. In the future It's like you see clearly, okay, better off, okay, happiness, perspective, clear headspace. It's like you're you're gaining clarity. Why is better off here in the immediate future for Aries? Okay. The Nine of Swords. Okay. Nine of Swords with the Knight of Cups. All right. This is you stressing about reciprocation. Okay. Um, with the Hermit energy and the Two of Cups. It's like I'm stressed around, you know, like this Knight of Cups energy. Like someone coming in and showing love and emotion. Okay. And it's making you think a lot about the relationship, the connection, the union, two of cups. Um, Eight of wands, energy, and the seven of swords is you maybe communicating something that wasn't known. Okay? Yeah. Why is better off here in the immediate future? Someone feeling stress. Why is better off here in the immediate future? Happiness, perspective, clear headspace. Okay. If you were stressed, maybe you're getting more clarity or changing your perspective in the immediate future. Okay. Two of Cups, the Eight of Wands, Three of Pentacles, and the Strength card.
the stress okay if you're experiencing any type of stress or anxiety or frustration in a union it's bringing about clarity for you okay um and with this eight of wands energy um this can be communication this can be movement um that allows things to that allows you to work things out okay yeah this is you yeah yeah if you've been experiencing any type of stress or anxiety when it comes to like this union or partnership um it clears your head space okay it brings about a different perspective that allows you to communicate to say what it is you want to say what it is you desire to say how you feel because you've been hiding it okay and it opens up an opportunity to rebuild okay um the strength card and the seven of course seven of swords on the bottom is saying that this may be resistance or this like clouded um energy could have come from you know dishonesty like you not being honest seven of swords okay yeah and to be honest that could be the reason why somebody else is kind of going back and forth as well okay it's like you both are not being clear about how you feel okay but this stress and, and anxiety around in this union is bringing about a different perspective okay that opens the door for cooperation getting on the same page three of pentacles something that might have been resisted okay so that's what i have for you should i hope this helped i look forward to seeing you guys soon please like hit the like button it's down there comment leave me a comment let me know what you think share send it to your friends post it to social media and subscribe so that you know when i post miss you guys already bye